Reporting on August 7, 2023. Breaking news. Infamous spyware shut down after data breach. Don't miss the shocking details. What does Let Me Spy software can do? Let Me Spy silently uploads the phone's text messages, call logs and precise location data to its servers, allowing the person who planted the app to track the person in real time. The Poland-based spyware Let Me Spy has announced its permanent shutdown after suffering a data breach in June. The breach resulted in the wiping out of its servers, including a vast amount of data stolen from thousands of victims' phones. In an English and Polish notice on its website, Let Me Spy confirmed that it will cease operations by the end of August, blocking users from logging in or creating new accounts. The hacker responsible for the breach gained unauthorized access to Let Me Spy's database, downloading and subsequently deleting data from the website. As a result, the spyware's app is no longer operational, and the website no longer offers the app for download. Let Me Spy was an Android phone monitoring app designed to remain hidden on a victim's home screen, making it difficult to detect and remove. Once installed on a target's phone, the app continuously stole messages, call logs, and real-time location data, often being planted by someone with knowledge of the victim's phone passcode. The leaked database, obtained by nonprofit Transparency Collective D. Do Secrets and analyzed by TechCrunch, revealed that Let Me Spy had been used to steal data from over 13,000 compromised Android devices worldwide. Prior to the breach, the spyware's website claimed to have control over more than 236,000 devices. The spyware was developed by a Krakow based tech company called Radial, but the chief executive, Rafal Lidwin, did not respond to requests for comment. Let Me Spy is just one of several spyware operations that have shut down recently following security incidents that exposed victims' data and the identities of the spyware's operators. SpyTrack, another spyware with over a million user records, was operated by Support King, a tech company that had been banned from the surveillance industry in 2021 by federal regulators due to its failure to secure stolen data from its previous flagship spyware app, SpyPhone. Thanks for watching. Like, comment and share.